Welcome to Packaging That Works. I'm Joanne Foreman. The flexible packaging industry has been feeling the growing impact of sustainability. Currently, we are seeing a transition of some bag packaging to mono materials for recycling at the store drop-off. The previous recyclable label system was confusing to consumers. Is it a one, a two, a four, maybe a seven? Consumer participation is a key part of being able to meet sustainability goals. Packaging that works for consumers will include these how to recycle labels in a way that makes them easy to locate and to read. Here we have four bag and box cereals, Wegmans Private Label, Kellogg's, Quaker Oats, and Nature's Path. These are a few of the cereals currently available with consumer instructions for recycling both the bag and box packaging components by using two side-by-side -side recycle symbols, one for the paper box and one for the store drop-off of the bag. We can expect to see many more bag and box packages with these dual instructions as the CPGs change the bag materials to comply with recycling requirements and update the box printing. As consumers need to see and understand these symbols to follow the recycling instructions, the size of the symbols and their printing on a contrasting background may make a difference in participation. Let's compare these symbols on the four boxes. Notice the red Wegmans box. It has larger printing of the recycle symbols on the contrasting background, and this is easier to read and understand. The smaller black and white symbols when placed on a white background are not as easy to locate. Good work, Wegmans! Nature's Path Rice Puffs Package is a store drop-off recyclable plastic bag. The store drop-off symbol is smaller and harder to read. Consumer participation in recycling is an important part of the circular economy. Packaging that works provides consumers with recognizable visuals to understand how to recycle their packages. A product package with multiple components, paper and plastic, can make recycling confusing for the consumer. However, a clearly labeled package can help consumers better participate in recycling. Many CPGs have committed to meeting reusable, recyclable, or compostable goals for their packaging by 2025. In the next decade, we can expect more focus on reusable and compostable packaging. Many challenges lie ahead, and new technologies in packaging in the recovery stream and changes to legislation will help create the roadmap to a circular economy. Thank you for joining me today for Packaging That Works. I hope you'll check out my future blogs.